Hi, welcome to Crystal's Diamond Painting. I'm Crystal. It's nice to see you guys. I wanted to ask you guys how you're doing, first of all. Hopefully this finds everyone doing happy and healthy, doing well. Uh, first of all, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and hit the notification bell, little bell. You know, hit it and it'll go ding each and every time I upload a video. But anyways, today I want to remind you that we're doing a giveaway. And I will try to put a picture of the pen up there. But there it is. Just be a subscriber and comment I want it and you'll be entered into the giveaway. I do apologize about the angle, but you'll see why in a minute. Um, so this is where I normally would say I'm going to move you down the table, but I've kind of already got you down and facing, I need to move this book, and facing the futon couch, which is laid out. Um, I have it sitting between my desk and the gaming area for the kids in our basement room. So, um, let me get right to this, okay? So you're gonna kinda see me at some weird angles. So we got our box here. It's got the holographic shine to it. On the back it has your instructions on what the kit contains, okay? You're going to peel back the film on the canvas, select the symbol that you want to work with, identify the color that matches the symbol, put the wax in the tip, put the beat the diamonds in the tray, shake them out softly, line them up, use your pen to pick them up, and place them onto the canvas in the corresponding dots or symbols, um, and that will get you where you're going. So anyways, there's that. Your toolkit. Sorry, I mean, this is kind of a weird angle. I don't know how else to really do this. This toolkit comes with a squishy, a tray, a pen, I'm making a mess by the way, a four placer, which is nice, it's a thin one, a bunch of baggies, and two patties of wax, and this kit actually came with two four-placers, two multi-placers. Um, um, obviously, I believe that was an accident, but, you know, it's nice to have an extra one. So anyways, all right, what else should we do? I wanna see what else we should do first. I wanna make sure I don't miss anything. This is kind of a weird one because of the angle it's in. I don't know how else to do this, so I do apologize. Um, you come with your little instruction booklet, which is nice when you are first starting off or you're giving it as a gift, so that way you can know exactly how to do it. So let me know what to do. Okay. So in a second, you're gonna see why I chose to do it this way and now you can see it is almost as long as this couch can be as easy as it's set up. There are the drills. And what we're going to do is we're going to go through the canvas real quick and show it to you and go through it um, and then we're going to pop through the drills real fast. Um, in a minute, but I want to look at this canvas first. Are you ready? One, two, three, go. Can you see him from there? It's the beast. It's the beast. Let me see if I can bring him closer. Do you see him? Can you see all of them? Isn't he gorgeous? rose down here. Isn't he gorgeous? All right, well he is an 18 inch by 54 inch, which is 46 centimeters by 137 centimeters. Let's check the sticky on this real quick. Yep, the sticky is good. Oh, I don't know why I didn't do this while I had him up here. Let's bring him back. All right, let's look at the key, 
Alright. As you can see, those are all really clear. Really easy to see. Yep. There are 55 colors. Looks like three ABs. Let's look at this drill field. Look how clear that looks. Super clear. And I will use a light pad and a track lighting behind it to help me see it so I'm not too worried about clarity. But the one good thing about Diamond Art Club is their clarity is spot on. Okay, this is Diamond Art Club's The Bees, Mandy Manzano. It's supposed to be 46 centimeters by 137 centimeters. Let's see. 45 and a half. Let's see. It's a little long. Hundred and thirty seven and a half. Oh, I was off a little bit, so probably hundred and thirty seven almost exactly. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay. So, I don't know how well you can see it that far away. Uh, I'm gonna bring it closer again. Try to find some ABs in here. Um, this is really hard to do. Let's see, there's some ABs in here. Alright, we've got ABs up in his eyebrows and his forehead. Up along this looks like a, maybe a moon. Um, let's see where else. There's some ABs down here in his face. They're just sprinkled a little bit throughout. So beautiful, so beautiful. I'm wondering if there's a bunch of ABs in the rows. Oh, there is, not a bunch, but a decent amount. Little bits throughout, just to highlight it. Um, yeah. Right, let's look at what kind of colors we have going on here. Oh, and these are labeled with the name of the piece, so if you want to keep it going separately from your canvas, you can. No, I do. Let's see. It's just black. I think what I'm gonna do. Hold on, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I got you down on the table. I know I can't show you everything on the table at once, but. I really couldn't get good lighting over on the futon couch to show you all of it at once. So unfortunately, we'll just have to keep it rolled onto on my desk and roll up part of it as we unroll the other part to show it to you. I don't know, that probably works a lot better than trying to hold it up and show it to you um, from the futon. But anyways, um, let's see. The little sticker is just like this. I put them on the front of my storage container. Um, now one of my YouTube people that I watch, Diamond Painting with Grace, she makes them into cover minders. If you wanna check that out, you're more than welcome to. I'm sure she would love the new patronage. Um, if you wanna step in and show her some love. Now here's your big sticker. I put the big sticker in my logbook and I photocopy the key code and I put a copy, a, a, a sticker of that into my key code. So when I cut off the outside, I can 
keep track of my drills in case they pop or anything happens. Now these are stickers, individual little stickers. And they go on to your um, containers, your, your baggies, whatever you choose to use for your for kidding up and keeping track of your stuff. Um, let's see, what else? We should probably go over the drills. I have them out and ready to go. There's a couple of little stragglers here. But, sorry for the crinkling. We're gonna real quickly just kind of peek at the colors that are available in this kit. That red. And there are some ABs, so these pink ones. Those are ABs. One, two, eight. That's number two. Okay. I did see. Number two and the flower, I thought. Let me go down to it. All right, so I see number two. Wait. I see number two in here and the flower a little bit. Just a few spots, just a few teeny tiny spots. But there's number two all over down in here, all over in here, all over in here, all over in here over here and here. It's that color. Let's see. That's an AB. This yellowish color, this fairly soft pale yellow. And that is number three. And that's in his eyebrows, those eyelids I should say. I see a bunch in his eyelids. Um, I see some throughout here on his little buckle. I don't know what else it is called. There's a couple throughout here, just kind of mixed in on his shawl. Okay. And then it's just mixed throughout his face. Yeah, it's just mixed it out. Okay, and there's another AB. It's a soft, kind of purpley pink color. That's number one. And I see that up here in his, in this, if this is a moon or what this is, I don't know what this is up here. Tell me what you think this is. Is this, what is this, is it a moon or what is this? I don't know. Anyways, it's in there. Um, not seeing a whole bunch anywhere else, but that doesn't mean there can't be a few here and there. But anyways, let's finish up these colors. We're almost done. Would I put any more ABs in this? Um, I don't know. I feel pretty satisfied with the amount that I'm seeing. Um, I might consider doing some red ABs and maybe his cloak up here and here. Maybe a few more red ABs into the rose itself. I'm not sure, we'll see. Um, we will see. But there he is, the beast, Manny Manzano, down the Nerd Club. Isn't he gorgeous? Just gorgeous. Sorry about back on the camera there. Just gorgeous. Can't wait to get him done. He will be a feet and a half. Yeah. What do you think? Do you like him? Do you think he's amazing? I think he's amazing. I've wanted him for a while, and it's been a while since he's been available. 
Um, every time I went to go get him, it was a get notified situation. So I've been waiting and waiting and finally I was able to get him. So, but anyways, here he is, the beast. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm gonna do a quick reminder again of the giveaway. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe and comment. I want it to be entered for a chance to win that pen. Um, it's a really pretty pen and I believe that whoever receives it will absolutely enjoy it and um, get good use out of it. So real quick, I'm gonna show it to you one more time. All right, so I hope you enjoyed the video today. Much love. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.